This is an HT handheld walkie-talkie radio antenna. And as you can see, this antenna is long. This antenna is fairly rigid, and this antenna is not optimal for concealed carry, transporting in small spaces, or talking a lot of fars. This is also an antenna. And as you can see, this antenna is much longer. This antenna is flaccid, making it fully optimized for concealed carry and transporting in very small areas. And this antenna is also very good at allowing your radio to talk many fars. This is the Fara J GMRS antenna, or as I like to call it, the Fars J GMRS antenna. But if you are one of those ham radio guys, let not your heart be troubled, because verily I say unto you that the Fars J antenna is also available in the 2 meters, 6 meters, and of course the 70 semen eaters flavor. However, for the purposes of this video, we will be discussing the GMRS flavored version. The cost for the Fars J GMRS antenna is $60 of monies. Affiliate link below. And for those of you warming up your fingers and about to leave a comment whining that $60 of monies is more than you paid for your radio, then shut up and don't buy one. You do not need to leave a comment demonstrating to the world how much of a crybaby you are. However, for those of you that are actually interested in getting more FARs with your radio, whether you paid $18 of monies or $300 of monies for your radio, then consider that this antenna costs about the same as a good quality mobile GMRS antenna. And I should also point out that my new best friend, Ben, at vfcoms.com, did send this miracle of modern antenna technology to me at no cost so that I could share it with you, my favorite viewer. As you can see, mine has been customized with these fancy letters, and for only a few monies more, you too can have your antenna customized to your Pacific taste and needs. And if you thought that walking around the park or the mall with a radio clipped to your vest was a good way to get the attention of chicks, my friend, just imagine how an antenna with your call sign on it will impress the chicks when you show it to them at the mall or in the parking lot. The advantage of this antenna is not just that it is great for concealed carry and transporting, but it also allows you to very easily get the antenna up high, such as in a tree or dangling from a flagpole or whatever you happen to have laying around, thusly allowing for maximum FARs, something that you cannot do with a handheld walkie-talkie antenna. And yes, you can also use this antenna with a mobile or base station radio. And even more importantly, you can also use this antenna in the bathtub or in the rain, and that is because this antenna has no moving parts and no wire. And if I understand how this magic works correctly, and if I am getting this part wrong, do not worry, because I'm sure that some people will correct me in the comments. As I understand it, this Faraday cloth is the actual antenna element. No metal, no wire, just this very magic Faraday cloth. And no, this antenna does not require any ground plane. Another advantage of this antenna is that unlike a regular antenna, if this antenna breaks, you can use it as a bandana, like the Rambo. When I first started testing this antenna, the very first thing that I noticed was that it has a BNC type connector. And this made me much enraged. But I then realized that a BNC connector, which, by the way, in case you are wondering, stands for Bayonet Network Connection, a BNC connector is actually a good thing because it allows for very fast and very easy connection and disconnection. The antennas are pre-tuned for whichever flavor you purchase, and as you can see, the antenna is indeed well-tuned or as us radio experts like to say, it is resonant for the GMRS. 
However, as you can also see with your very own vision sensing sacks, objects such as my skin and bones will affect how this or any antenna performs. So you would be well advised to keep this or any antenna at least several inches away from any obstructions for maximum FARs. As mentioned only moments ago, one of the main advantages of this antenna is that you can get it up high, which, due to the laws of physics, will result in more FARs. But just using this antenna at arm's length, you will get more FARs than most standard HT handheld walkie-talkie antennas. And to demonstrate that claim, I used this radio. My Radio Dua Diddy GM30 Plus. To talk to my friend Conrad, the chef at his house, 13 miles away, using each antenna, so as to compare the signal quality of each antenna to the other. And just for decomfoculation's sake, I was transmitting on simplex, direct radio to radio, no repeater, mono e mono. And my friend Conrad the chef was using a large antenna on the roof of his humble abode. And this is how the two antennas sounded. Testing the stock antenna, 13 miles away. One, two, four, two, five. Testing from 13 miles away. Using the far J roll up and set it. One, two, three, four, five. So if you are looking for a well made concealed carry antenna that will also gain you more FARs, then just click on the affiliate link below. <laughs>